So you look at this set, and it's beautiful. And you think, man, there's probably something really valuable in there. And you open it up, and there's stuff that might be valuable to some people. How many of you actually knew what these things were? One, two, three, four, five, six. And you only knew it because of her. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> so most of us, you, you open that up and say, huh? thought there was going to be something really valuable. So it's just a hump of plastic and a funny shaped piece of metal. But the covering was so nice. Isn't that the way we are sometimes? Nice blue, nice blue shirt, fancy footprint tie, white house on it. Doesn't he look really holy? And inside, I and you are filled with sinful desires, sinful motivations, selfishness, and pride. You don't see that from the outside. God sees the inside. And not only does God see the inside, God cleans up the inside. So that even the inside of the bag is pretty neat up. Well, Lord, you thought it would be on one. I had no idea what to do with these. But you can't read a book by the cover. Those people you may consider to be really great people because they look like it. They're sinners. At best, they are sinners saved by grace. And some of those people you look at and say, look at that filthy, disgusting person. All they are is a sinner. And some of them, sinners saved by grace too. You cannot tell by simply looking at the outside. Amen. You need to get to know the people on the inside. God sees the inside. God cleans the inside. God makes the inside just as valuable, much more valuable than the outside. Think about that when you see these fancy bags. Hey, they're cozy. Turn them in the back. You got more music.